What's up ladies and gentlemen, this is PS Probo 101 and I'm here with a quick tutorial to show you guys how to add arena files, um, arena POC files to Smackdown vs. World 2011 or 2010 for PSP. And, cause a lot of people have been asking me how do you install the arenas, cause, you know, um, I made a couple mods, arena mods, and people have been asking me how to install it, so. In this video, I'll show you guys how to install it. This is not actually showing you guys how to texture hack the arenas themselves, but it's just showing you how to install it to the game. Sorry, I'm kind of sick right now, so kind of bear with me. But anyways, download the files in the description. I included a link for um the arena values and um, UMD gen and two arenas to um start you guys off with. So I'm going to go download my two arenas. Um, where is it? Right here, the Raw 2012 arenas. I'm gonna download it. Alright, I can minimize that. And uh, go to where you extracted it, of course. Blah blah blah. Where did I download this? Uh, here we go. Drag it to my desktop. And extract the files, of course. Yeah, after that you don't need that anymore. But these are the two um pack files for you know the arenas. And to install them, first of all you, you, you wanna know what arenas you wanna replace. Um so you can look at the arena values that I extracted. I just took the time to extract all the arena um and figure out all the arena files, which is which, which arenas is which. And you're gonna wanna look at this to see which arena you wanna replace. So for this video, um, I'm not going to actually replace um, an arena because I already did it. Well, yeah, I already did it, but yeah. But I'm going to show you guys how to. But um, For this one, since we have the raw arenas, um, I'm going to install raw 1000. And I'm going to replace this raw, right? So first, you're going to want to... Um, open up the ISO, whichever ISO you have. In this case, this is a modded SmackDown 2000, 2011, my WW11. These are the files you're gonna have to extract. Extract the plus psp.arc. Extract it to your desktop. And open up BG. This is where all the, um, the hacked arenas are. And extract that as well. And yeah, do you need this? Uh, you don't need it right now. You'll just reopen it. But now you have these two files, the two main files to add in the arena to the game. You're going to have to, where's my hex editor right here? Open up your hex editor and drag both of those files to it. PLSPSC.arc and the BG.pot file. And now drag the raw arena, raw 1000. So here's a Royal 1000 Arena, you're going to want to go down and copy the whole thing. I just copy a little bit off the end and then go to um, zero to highlight the entire thing instead of highlighting the whole thing yourself which takes forever. And now that you did that, just like adding selection picks, you're going to want to, the bg.poc file, you want to go all the way to the bottom right here right and the row 1000 you're gonna copy and paste it right here at the end offset you want to make sure it's a valid offset it should end with 000 or 800 after you um paste it so you paste insert paste insert it and the the file has been um pasted into it and just to make sure you could go to um find again reversed and search pac search it backwards and this is the file you just added to the game the raw arena so once you did that you could basically just save it and it's going to turn everything regular color. So yeah, after you and 
you look at the offset, make sure you write down these numbers, um, whichever, whichever offset you paste it at. So this is the bg.poc file, the arena file. This is the new arena that you just posted. And this is the new offset that it's at. Now it's time to add it to the game officially by going to the plist psp.arc file. You're going to um, search. Well, it makes no sense searching anything because it's like right here in front of you. As soon as you open the plist psp.arc file, you should see stg right here. Um, you could scroll down just a little bit, not much. And all of these right here are the values of the arena, right? So you want to go back to the arena value and look at which one is which. That's how you know which arena is which one. Like 0000, zero, zero, zero is SmackDown, 0001 zero, 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 Raw, and like so forth, so forth. So I want to replace 0001, which is the Raw arena, the current Raw arena. Now you go right here, you see it right here, 0001. Now the um, values is, um, I'm trying to see if it's before or after. Um, it's after, yeah. Looking at it after right here. So you're going to want to change the values after. After the um, the number. So this is a raw arena that I'm changing. And you're going to go to right here. Now how you do this is quite simple. It's just like adding selection picks or, or anything like that. You want to make sure you have that value right there. You're going to want to open up the hex calculator. <laughs> here comes the math. I hate math, so I don't know how I'm so good with this, understanding this at all. But you're going to want to enter that value that you have in the bg.poc file, which is 996, 996, um, 800, or whichever value you have. Just follow the same thing I'm doing. You divide that by 800, right? And then you minus that by 8. And that's how you get the first values that you have right here. So. You'll go right here, go back to the plist psp.arc, and change the, this value right here. And the game reads back to um, um, right to left, I believe, instead of left to right, or some 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 crazy foolishness like that. So you're gonna change it right here to it's gonna be 2513 instead of 1325. That's how you that's how you're gonna enter it into the game. Now the next two values that you have to find is for the um the actual file size of the um the file that you add in. So since we added the raw 1000, go right here. You want to figure out the properties. You want to copy this number right here, right? So that number is let me minimize that 264, which is the file size. You click AC 264. And one nine two. One nine two. You divide that by one hundred and then you add one to it. And you do the same thing as before, you add it um right to left. So it's gonna be forty two twenty six. Which is what's already there because I already added arena so I have that arena currently right now so yeah that's how you do it and once you do that you just save it save make sure you save the um the bg.poc file and once you save it it should look like this everything look good and now you could just exit that out exit all that out and now that you have these two files completed all you got to do now is go back to UMD gen Open up the ISO you want to add it to. My WW11. You go right here. PLS PSP .arc. Of course, you delete it. Add this one right here. PLS PSP .arc. And now you delete this one. BG.POC. And you add it right here. And that's basically it. And one last final step. You go to File. File this export. You could just type in anything hit enter and then go to file list and import what you exported um which is right here open or hit enter and make sure you click yes always click yes and that's it there's your iso just save it as iso hello youtube um raw arena
arena video i type slow so and there you go that's your iso comment rate subscribe um you know you guys could like me on facebook here's my facebook page um you know you guys could talk to me anytime and stuff like that see i just posted that i'm <laughs> i'm actually doing the tutorial and i don't know what save data that he's talking about which save data are you talking about um how do you put your raw arena pack <laughs> video is recording right now you will be on youtube so yeah guys you know you guys could talk to me it doesn't have to be necessarily about hacks or anything like that you could just talk to me feel free and my personal um twitter you see that's my my the real me right there um i mostly send tweets out to layla you know and stuff like that you guys could tweet me as well i'll reply to you and yeah that's basically it so um comment rate subscribe like me on facebook like me on twitter and all that good stuff peace out